Here with Aidan DeCamper having a, a chat about his two runners on Friday night for Jess Moore. Uh, firstly, race four, number two, multi-bet returns from a spell. A uh, wonderful standing start horse always thereabouts. Uh, has Jess given you any ideas how this horse is going at the track? Yeah, um, obviously probably his form last time in towards the end probably tapered off a fair bit. Um, he's a very good standing start horse, so um, with a safe beginning, put him on the fence. You know, he's always a chance to run into some money there. But, um, you know, first up, we might take a run to come roost top. Race number eight is the uh, big drive for you, and that is Tricky Sticks Drawn Barrier 8. She's first up as well. Uh, small field, 2,500 seemed to be on her side of the ledger, but uh, there seems to be a lot of depth in the race. How have you, how have you assessed it? Yeah, I'm um, obviously looking forward to getting back behind the big girl. You know, she's probably my favourite horse to drive, probably because she goes so good. But um, at the same time, you know, she's... Um, you know, I'm really excited that she's back racing and see what she can do this prep. You know, obviously, first up this time in, no trial, although um, Jess tells me she has had a lot of work and is pretty fit. You know, um, small field does help, gives us options early. Probably knowing Jess pretty well, he'd probably opt to go back from the start and um, come home over the last lap. But, um, you know, with a bit of genuine tempo, you know, she's definitely got the class to win it. But um, just being first up and not knowing 100% where she's at, but she's definitely got the class on her side. Last preparation, she really took that next step that she needed to take, winning the Narragin Cup and, of course, the uh, Group 2 Pinjarra Cup. Uh, are you excited to think that she could go to another level racing the better horses? Yeah, definitely. You know, um, probably the Narragin Cup probably wasn't as good as free-for-all as what um, the best have been racing this year. And the Pinjarra Cup was better again, but still didn't have the real, real good ones in it, you know. But she is a four-year-old mare taking on... A lot older seasoned horses in them races and she managed to get the job done you know I thought her Pinjara Cup run was the best of her career you know she really fought deep um, to hold off a seasoned horse when she she did cop, cop a bit of pressure and get headed you know so yeah I'm really excited to see this prep and hopefully she can keep improving and match with the big boys. All the best on Friday night with her as well as Multibet and exciting to uh, excited to see how she goes this preparation all the best. Cheers mate.